Today we are talking about stealth camping or stealth parking. I am going to talk you through my decision making process on how I pick spots for the night. So come on, let's roll. Got my coffee cup to go and I'm gonna hit the road tonight. This ended up being a great place to stealth park for the night. Let me show you why. For one, it has a really nice little grassy area right here for Bella to get out and pee. Let me show you. There she is. So there's a nice walkway and grassy area. And as you can see, the van is right there. And there's, if you look, there's no tenant in this spot here it's available so nobody is like first thing in the morning people won't be going into that business so that makes it a really good spot plus the meters um only work during the day so you know after 6 p.m there's no meter so it's free to camp or free to be on the street at night until 9 a.m and 9 a.m the meters start again so if you move the van by nine you're in good shape your pee pee spot getting a spot to go pee pee and when we go for walks we have her cart right here which I absolutely love there'll be some info about it in the description box below but she rides inside her spot here I can put my purse or whatever up here or you can pull it right there anyway it's great for shopping or walking around and here she is getting some nice time on the grass oh you love it it's so nice out here tonight so I love it I love being on the grass Okay, so let's walk across and check it out. Here we are. And as you can see, there's no tenant in this building, so it's empty. And then, if you look at the meter, hours of operation 9 to 6 p.m. So... And there's the cart with Bella over there. So it makes a really good spot for the evening. I always look for side streets, by apartments, by hotels. I was stayed there down the street the other night. And now I found a spot for tomorrow night. Right, Bella? We got a spot for tomorrow night pricked out. It's perfect show you guys that tomorrow huh Bella see I love van life right Bella we love it we love it even stealth parking in the city huh yeah if you look around there's another casino Big building over there, all these big buildings around. A few days. Alright, so let's go across. And find some place to park. I see the sands.
this looks like the perfect spot because on the right is the casino and it's fenced in. They're doing construction and then on the left are all these parking spots. So I'm going to park here. Okay. So here's the sands, but on that side, if you look out the window, is where most of the parking is, and they're doing some construction. So I don't think anybody would mind anybody parked here. So this is where it's going to be, go. to the new spot. the Sands Casino and Hotel and if you look let me turn we are in the guest and oversized vehicle parking and there's the van back there and there's only a couple of other it's a big big parking lot see there's an RV there another work truck one little car And nobody else, so this is where we will be staying for the night. Day and night, but anyway. Just go inside, have, have a meal or gamble or something, and then you're a guest, basically. Is a truck stop so there's lots of places to park and back here at the truck stop as well 
So this little plaza thing is a great place to stealth park for the night. Because there's people around, there's a store, you can get a shower here, and then there's lots of places to park in the parking lot. You know, fast food places, so yeah, this is a place I would look, definitely stealth park for the night. After looking back at all that footage, I was like, oh my gosh, thank goodness I got a haircut. Oh, my hair was a mess. <laughs> anyway, I just want to thank you guys for sticking around till the end. I hope that I have given you information and inspired you to get out and enjoy life because nature truly is the best medicine, even if you're urban camping. You see new environments, you enjoy the great outdoors, you're breathing fresh air, you're seeing all kinds of different things and you are not remaining stagnant so those of you that want to know more about the cart that was shown in the video or the carrier that bella rides in please go down to the description box below we have our link for our amazon storefront and even if you don't purchase anything from the storefront but you buy something else in amazon and you put it in your cart using our link we get a small little um, commission for that if you do buy something within 24 hours. So we appreciate every penny you guys help us out with. Also, there's other links for ways you can support the channel in the description box. And if you want to join our Van Clan, which is our channel membership, it's there too. Definitely want to thank all the Van Clan members that keep us on the road and put gas in our tanks. We really, really appreciate you guys. You guys will definitely want to watch this video next because it's an oldie but a goodie and you probably haven't seen it. See you next video. Bye.